Another push for peace in the war-torn Eastern DRC, the UN Intervention Brigade that includes South Africa, is playing a crucial role. We defeated M23, which, is, which was the biggest. Now we are defeating ADF, and I think the next will be FDLR and some other uh, local, uh, small local groups. A huge concern, the future of FDLR remnants. They are also a threat to Rwanda and a source of diplomatic tension. The FDLR has indicated it's willing to lay down arms. Twenty years ago there was a genocide in Rwanda and we, do, we all do recall uh, about that. And um, uh, number one, I think that there is a very strong political commitment of the government of Rwanda to make sure that these people are integrated. And if they are not, if they stay in the DRC, they should as well be integrated there so that they no longer think about war. So I think we all want peace. And therefore, so we need to keep on discussing. President Jacob Zuma and his Rwandan counterpart met for the first time since expelling each other's diplomats. Hope within the region that they can heal the widening rift. President Zuma is here. He has been invited. And uh, I do hope that uh, this is a good opportunity for presidents to talk about anything that may be of concern for the region. The one-day summit is a follow-up to a January meeting. Mahlatsi Gallens, SABC News, Luanda, Angola.